Hello and welcome to Megger's Technical Support Videos, where today we will be discussing the Power Factor Form 93500 tip-up test. The first step is to open up the appropriate PowerDB software, which in this case is PowerDB Lite version 11.2.9. Once open, you can see the selection of instruments in which we will be choosing the Delta 4000 Power Factor test set using the Power Factor 2 winding transformer 93500 test form. Okay, once the form is open, we'll have our header information up top followed by our nameplate information, our test selections, which we will choose manual test for this, and our power factor test chart. Below that we have our manual test or our multiple quick test in which we would like to open the Delta Control. The Delta Control opens up this window here and you can choose from the different test modes you'd like to to perform and the different tests down here. So you have power factor, excitation, current, and auto tip-up test, which is what we are interested in for this video. You can select your frequency as well as the temperature. And to perform this test, you would select your voltage. So if we wanted to go up to 10 kV, Ultimately, we would have to just select our increments at this point, in which we would go to Settings. And down at the bottom left, we have Auto Tip-Up Test and Kilovolt per step. So in each step, how much do we want to go up in voltage? So let's do 10 steps for 1 kilovolt each. We can also choose the method of suppression, whether we would like no suppression, which is a straight output, or if we want fre frequency variation, which is the default uh, suppression. So now that we have, have that selected, if we start this test, it would increment in one kilovolt steps up to 10 kilovolts, and that would be our tip-up test. You could view that through the graph also, if you wanted to choose tip-up, and it would show you voltage in your x-axis, as well as power factor in your y-axis. All right, well that discussed the tip automatic tip test. Stay tuned for other videos with more information. Thank you, bye. Thanks for watching this installment of Megger's technical support videos and tune into some of our other videos for more information.